Okay, guys, here we are on the Cellu Core stand, part of the massive nutrition systems activation we've got happening here at the Sydney Fitness Show. We've got our very special guest with us, Cellu Core athlete Jen Jewell. Jen, welcome to Sydney. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so excited to be here. Is this your first time here? No, it's actually my second time here in Australia, but both visits have been for fitness and getting to work with everyone else on their own health and fitness goals. So. How do you like Australia? Oh my gosh, I love it. It's great. The people are so nice, so welcoming, and it's gorgeous here. Excellent. Yeah, yeah nice. Yeah. So tell us about yourself. I understand you're based in, in California. Well, I actually just moved. I was born and raised in California, but I just moved to Texas. So I actually live quite close to the Cellucor headquarters now. You guys need to come check it out sometime. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. So I've been working now with Cellucor for five years, and I've been working back in the field of health and fitness for the past five years. So long story short, I worked in health and fitness way back in high school, teaching aerobics when I was 16 years old. Wow. And then personal training throughout college. After college, I went and got a corporate America job and decided, you know what, that wasn't for me. I wanted to get back to being able to help other people with their health and fitness, because that's truly what I love to do, is help other people achieve their goals. And so I quit my corporate job five years ago and have been working in fitness ever since. Excellent. And, and tell us about your own uh, personal weight loss journey, because I understand you've, you've been on a bit of a journey yourself, yeah? I, you know what? It, I always say I'm always a work in progress, but I have had a little bit of a, a journey over the years. Years back, um, I had I, I lost a really close friend, and so that really threw me for a loop. I wasn't myself, and I started eating unhealthy. Um, you know, I made new friends, and we were very social. We'd go out to eat all the time. We'd have wine, desserts. And that's all fine in moderation, but I was not doing it in a moderated way. Um, I was still working out, but my workouts, I was just so bored. And finally it hit when I realized, oh my gosh, I had to buy a pant size. And I don't know how the pant sizes um, translate here, but I'll just put it in perspective. Like now I wear like a two or a three in US. Yeah. I had to buy a size 13. Right. Yeah. yeah, so I was over 35% body fat. And I was like, oh, well, we gotta do something to bring oh, this back. We've all had those moments. <laughs> right, yeah. yeah. Well, I also realized, you know, when you're not eating healthy food, when you're not working out, or just not even like training six, seven days a week or anything crazy like that, but yeah. when you're just not active and pushing yourself, or if you're not enjoying it, yeah. it affects you all around. So your energy levels are gonna be lower, because my energy levels were lower. I wasn't, I guess, as peppy as I am now and stuff like that. So um, from that day, when I realized I had to buy that size, I went, all right, we gotta get this back. So I started to um, make changes in my diet, obviously, and cut back going out to eat, making healthier food for myself at home. But I didn't do anything crazy restrictive, and I think that's really important to note, is I knew that wasn't going to be realistic for me or sustainable. So I still kept desserts in a couple of times a week. I still ate out with my friends, but maybe instead of going to a happy hour, I like, let's go to yoga, okay. let's go to spinning, or let's go to the beach to go for a run. Yeah. And so that gradually, slowly but surely, my, my pant sizes started to drop, my body fat started to drop, energy levels went up, and then years later, I, in 2011, I finally stepped on stage to compete for the first time. Excellent. So, well, yeah. well, now that it's all sort of settled down, you've worked out kind of exactly where you want to be by the sounds of things. Tell us what what's a typical day in the life of, of Jen Jill? Well, right now, nothing's really typical because my calendar just got jam-packed with fun and, um, international fitness events like this. Yeah. But, so I, I love to be active. So whether that means I'm hitting the gym or I have a mountain bike and I live by a lot of trails and stuff like that. So I ride my bike three to five days a week. Um, I like to get outside. I'll go on a hike. So, you know, every day is a little bit different. Um, in the morning, you know, wake up, have my healthy breakfast. Sometimes I'll pop outside and listen to a podcast. So if I'm riding my bike and stuff like that, I call it my podcast and twirl. Yeah. So it's something where I'm learning, but I'm being active that day just to get up and move it. Yeah. Um, a lot of times during the day, I'm very sedentary. I write a lot of articles. So I'm on my computer a lot. I'm writing programs for clients. I'm writing new programs and workout guidelines for my website. And then at some point that day, I get to the gym. If I'm on the road like I am right now, then I get outside like I did yesterday, and I did the stairs at the Sydney Opera House. Oh, excellent. <laughs> I'm not yeah. sure if that's that allowed or not, nice. but I did that, yeah. so yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And yeah. Uh, the partnership with uh, with Cellular Corp, yeah. all going really well. Oh my gosh, I'm so fortunate that as soon as I started working in fitness, I got paired up with Cellular Corp, and I've been working with them for five years now. And it's just so amazing to see how the company has grown worldwide. You know, we started, the first expo I ever did, we had a little table like this big, and we were just handing the 
just step out like, hi, we're here. Yeah. And now look at this. You know, yeah. never in a million years would I have yeah. imagined that I'd be here in Australia yeah. getting to represent this company. Yeah. So, Excellent. I love the people, love the culture. Oh, nice. yeah. And so the show here, we're on for three days. Yeah. What are you uh, expecting over the next three days? What can our visitors expect when they pop by and say hello? Well, I'm here to help. So for anyone who's coming by, I want you to feel free to ask me whatever health and fitness questions you might have. You know, don't be shy. Come up, introduce yourself. Like, that's why I'm here, is to meet all of you guys here, to meet as many people here in Australia as I can, and again, help you guys all with your health and fitness in one way or another. So. There you go, Jen Jewell. Pop on down to the Cellucor booth here at the massive Nutrition Systems Activation. It's the biggest stand in the whole show. Jen will be most happy to meet you, have her photo with you. Jen, thanks so much. It was lovely to meet you and all the best with everything. Thank you. Lovely to meet you as well. And thank you guys for having me. I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Awesome. Thank you.